Welcome back to the Morning Blend. This is a sophomore LP from Brett Newski titled Land, Air, Sea, Garage. It's about diving into the world with no safety net and landing on your feet. So you could say it's a little bit autobiographical. Mm -hmm. When Brett was 25, he quit all of his part-time jobs to become a full-time nomad, playing music in nooks and crannies around the globe, and most recently opening for the Violent Femmes in California. We're thrilled to welcome Brett to the Yellow Couch. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. Take risks. Wait for no man, don't die. Crusty adventures, keeping it DIY. Can I drink out of this? Yeah, you can. Okay. You can have it. We, we sometimes you should. say it, it looks good. Prop. Yeah. It does, yeah. <laughs> can I keep this? You can keep that. <laughs> yes, in fact. you can. Yeah. We have newer ones though that Ooh. you might like. Yeah, better. yellow ones. Uh -huh. Um I'll, so I'll you like it. it here on the yellow couch? Yellow couch is cool. That was pretty weird, you guys, uh, when the lady was getting massaged on the news. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of wild, yeah. right? Was she even alive? <laughs> she was alive. You saw a tilt of the head here and there. No, she, she was just that relaxed. It's like your producer's like, rent a corpse. You know? <laughs> yeah. And then we had the urn earlier. Yeah, yeah right. No. Oh, so I want to talk, because I'm a mom, about your nomad, your nomad lifestyle. You lived in your car for two months in Europe. Right? I've never lived in my car. I've slept in it a lot. Okay. You know, I sleep okay. in it a lot. Um, usually we stay with friends or, you know, cheap hotels on tour when we when we can. So it's, yeah. it's often though that you don't, you, you might not know on a given day where you're going to sleep that night or maybe next week or something like that, right? Yeah, well, it's getting to the point where I'm definitely less homeless, you know? Um, <laughs> I used to, yeah, so, which is good, because you can't do that. It's like wears on your brain a lot when you yes. got to, like, wait for some guy at the bar to finish partying so you can go sleep at his house. You know, it's just like, you can't sustain that. <laughs> and I, I don't want to keep doing that and just completely hate myself, you know. And you slept in your mom's basement last night, right? Yeah, last night I did. Um, I got home from eight weeks of tour in Europe, and then we did some shows with the Violent Femmes, or my heroes, out west. Um, How did that come to be? Oh. What happened? Um, How did they find you or you find they're, them? They're, they're also from Milwaukee, you know, mm -hmm. so I, I mean, the, the sounds have sonically been compared and then okay. um, the local music writer, Piet Levy, good dude, actually got me in touch with them a couple years ago and then mm -hmm. <clears throat> I went out to Tasmania to play Brian Ritchie, the bass player, has a festival out there, mm -hmm. so yeah. Is it stressful to your mom that you um, <laughs> sleep in your car and, and stuff like that? She hates it. She texted. <laughs> she texted my girlfriend before the show and telling me not to like do anything dumb. Does your girlfriend <laughs> travel around with you? How does that work? Uh, yeah, sometimes. Does you know. she sleep in your car? She's my band psychologist. <laughs> um, Everybody yeah. needs one, right? She's shaking, shaking yeah, her head. Yep. <laughs> it's not healthy. My car is named Chuck Reg in the car. He's <laughs> actually awesome. he's it lives in Dusseldorf, Germany, <laughs> and he's. It's a pretty famous car. Like, yeah. I mean, it's a piece of crap, but yeah. you know, it's never let me down. You were blackmailed and about your car? Got blackmailed once. Yeah, we have a YouTube series documenting all this. It's called Crusty Adventures. Yes. Yeah. So it's like, when, you know, we do a lot of DIY touring and stuff goes wrong, you know, and like, for sure, it's not glorious, you know. I don't get to play theaters with the Violent Femmes very often, you know, all the time. So it's cool. But uh, now morale is kind of restored after doing something like that. And mm -hmm. I love the crusty adventures idea. It's just so real. Where's your Where's the fa your favorite place that you've been? Because you've been so many different. Living in you know four different continents. You know, in Milwaukee five years. is pretty underrated. I've I've liked living here. I think it's been a good base camp. You know. Yeah. Um, but it's a good place to, to base camp out of, and, uh, you know, America's not the easiest country to live in. I think it's pretty tough for people, you know. Mm -hmm. It's, like, super competitive, really competitive, mm -hmm. but also, like, there's a lot of opportunity. So, yeah, we kind of, like, live or die by the merch table and old school and selling vinyl and CDs. Yeah, let's see it. We got, we got oh, wait, these units. Oh, wait, you got to explain this picture right here. Oh, Boom. we just went oh. past oh, okay. the, the well, inflatable see, pool. We got these units. We got to shift them. We got to sell these people, units. He's, units, he, we got to shift them. He needs a place to shift, sleep, people. Shift, shift, we we got to get one. How much are they? <laughs> if we don't shift these units. What do they cost? Units, They're free. What do no, they cost? My they? career is over. I don't know. <laughs> But we got, come to this show, buy Your the mom's units. like, don't show, throw where's the CDs show at? Show we, got, uh, we got Hottest New Record in Brown Deer right now. <laughs> hottest New Record in Brown Deer. <laughs> Brett Newski. Show uh, us if your you don't, uh, if, you, if you come to the show, you get a, you get a free poster. Uh, if you don't come to the show, you don't get the poster! <laughs> Sick of this DIY crap. I'm DIY. I'm punk as fuck. Don't need your money.